What's up guys? Uh, welcome back to Pokemon Heart Gold version. Uh, this will be a randomizer, and I know this is not the first time you guys watch me play this game, but I thought because of the new ability to record, um, the me playing Heart Gold again, that I was going to jump back into this uh, series. I will be joined once again with King Stratos, who will be linked in the description below. Uh, but without further ado, I'm going to jump right into the game. Alright guys, let's go check out this village. Let's see what we have to do first to get started in the game. We don't have the running shoes yet, guys, so it's going to be kind of slow. Oh, there's a Meryl. Or a Zumeril. Random Pokemon runs up on you. Trying to figure out what the heck's going on. And she just walks away, doesn't even thank me, doesn't, doesn't even apologize, alright. So I think I'm going to go right to trying to find uh, which Pokemon's going to be my starter, guys. I was, this lady looks nervous. Uh, I guess I can't talk to her. Well, I can't talk to her. I'm just going to... Okay. Why is this lady leading me around like this? Uh, she's telling me that Pokemon like to jump out of tall ground. Okay. I need to get my Pokemon first. Alright. I want to go on an adventure. Stop it. Okay. Fine. Uh, Professor Elm. Over here. Give me my Pokemon. So guys, King is also playing this game right now, uh, and just so you know, he, his game is also randomized, so he's playing Soul Silver, I'm playing Heart Gold, and um, the starter Pokemon will be all randomized, so I'm not even sure what the three Pokemon are going to be. You're going to see it the same time I see it, and we're going to see what we have to pick from. I remember our first playthrough with this, I believe I got a Raikou, and Kane got a Shaman. Uh, we both got legendary starters. Um, Raikou was overpowered. I mean, getting a, a legendary in the beginning is so overpowered. I both hope I get a legendary, and I also hope I get a Pokemon with at least two evolutionaries um, chains. Just because, I, I mean, I like the, the ability to actually like evolve your starter Pokemon. Real fast, guys, before I click these Pokemon, I do want to make a couple things clear. Pokemon randomizer. So all the Pokemon in this game that we're going to encounter will be randomized. Uh, there might be legendaries. There might be uh, evolved Pokemon in tall grasses. I don't know what's going to pop up. Not only that, their typing are going to be slightly randomized. So we might have uh, a Totodile that's normally a water type. Might be a grass type. So we have no idea what we're walking into right now in terms of what these Pokemon are and what their typing are going to be. Uh, but I am hoping I get a couple good ones to pick from and we can add them right to the party. Let's check it out. Now, normally we start left to right, starting with the farther left, farther, farthest left Pokeball, but we're gonna start in the middle because this one rotates. So the very first one is a Curlia. A Curly, I can't even say it. Curlia, yeah, a ghost type Pokemon. I don't know how I feel about that. We got a Mareep, the psychic type. Okay. Oh wait, one direction. And a Charmander, the rock type Pokemon. Oh, oh, okay. Now I like the idea of a. Even though I can't say this Pokemon's name. I like the idea of, of it being a ghost type, uh, which means that it is immune to fighting types normal types. Um, the Marit, the Psychic type, eh, I don't know how I feel about that, uh, but Charmander, the Rock type. 
Uh, if I'm thinking ahead strategically, I know a lot of water types tend to pop up. Um, which I guess for either way would have been the downfall of the Charmander. Um, so I'm going to go with Charmander, because at least we know it evolves. Um, yes, guys, I'm going with the Charmander. This is technically a Gen 1 starter. Um, now, for normal... Uh, randomize the rules, guys. You must give your your Pokemon nicknames. Now, the the typical one to give any fire solid is always Blaze or something like that. But I'm actually going to go a little bit more personal than that. Um, I think I'm going to name him Drago. Even though I know... Uh... He's not technically a dragon type, and even in this one, he's a rock type, but I've always thought of this Pokemon as a dragon type, or a, a built off of a dragon design. Of course, guys, Professor Elm is going to hand us the Pokedex, um, and all those other good stuff and walking us through the normal Pokemon essentials for those of my Pokemon fans out there uh, you will understand the significance of just like the Poke, uh, Poke Nav, um, your Pokedex, telling about the PC and the Pokemon healer. So let's check this guy out. Oh, I want to check out Drago first. Okay guys, give me some potions, um, which is good. Because once I, once I die, guys, once I die, that's it. My Pokemon are gone. They have to be st oh, they're not gone, gone, but they, I must put them back into the PC. Um, and the only way I could actually potentially revive them or revive that Pokemon is by beating the Elite Four. But, for right now, I don't think we're going to have to worry about that too much. But let's check them out. Let's check out the team. So Drago, the rock type. So Charmander, aka Drago, is a rock and bug type. Uh oh. I didn't see the bug part before, guys. Um, Alright, it is strong willed, and it's a lax nature, which makes me worried. Um, right now, so it's up on defense, guys, and low on special defense. And everything else looks to be pretty fine. Uh, its ability is speed boost. Its speed stat is, grad is gradually boosted. I actually like that. It means I'll be attacking first a lot the longer I'm in battle. Um, so I can accept that. Uh, right now it knows superpower, power gem, mimic, and sp spatial rend. Whoo! Whoo! All right, that's a whole another type of move, guys. Uh, I believe that Polky is. That's Polkia's um, special attack, spatial rend. And to have superpower, whew, that is uh, quite the start. Um, all right, guys. But as you know, the uh, the randomizer does not truly start until I get my first my first set of Pokeballs. Oh, here's Lyra. Tell me I should talk to my Pokemon more. Thank you for the advice. Maybe you should talk to your one more because it keeps running away. The salt is real. All right, so now I'm gonna continue on, guys. Oh, oh. Why are you stopping me now? I have a Pokemon. Thank you, ex expositional lady. Telling me everything I need to do in real time so I don't forget. It's been a long time since I played this game, guys. I always feel bad for your mom in these games. Because, like, you never see a father figure around except for Ruby and Sapphire. Uh, and then uh, Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald. And, uh... Your mom seems to be the only character in the game, and then you're like, all right, mom, I'm like 10 years old. I'm just going to go out and, you know, battle battle gangsters and capture very powerful god Pokemon. 
you can stay home and watch my room for me. Also, you ever notice how your mom never has a room in these houses? Why? Is, is she a robot? Is she autonomous? Does she just not sleep? She always asks me if I want to sleep. Does she ever sleep? Do we share a bed? These are questions I need to know. Yes, I remember how to make a phone call. Yet you tell me anyways. Why even bother? Alright. Really looking to I get, looking forward to when I get to Cherry Grove when I can uh get those running shoes, guys. Professor Elm stopping me again. But they don't want me to leave. Oh, he's giving me his number. That's quite forward for an old man. I mean, it's 2018, so I guess anything's possible, but, I mean, to give your number to a little boy, I'm just a little bit suspect. I don't know how I feel about that. All right, guys, so I don't have the Pokeballs yet, so I actually do not have the ability uh, to capture anything yet, so these won't actually count as my first encounters, but we will get a sense of what can be pulled from these, this area, and also, I could train up a little bit. It also means if I fall and die now, I actually will not die. Permanently. So first is a Voltorb. It's pretty nice. I'm using superpower. I should have used something else. I know I don't have the uh, the attack. Uh, noises on guys um, partly for the recording but I have this really nice background music for you so don't be too upset wasn't too bad for a battle train him up a little bit hey you went up a level dragon went to level 6 Alright guys, so I just finished another battle, and, um, yeah, I level up to level 7, and Charmander says I can learn a new move, it says I can learn Camouflage, not exactly sure what's going on with his move set at the moment, um, I mean, I, I can't really complain, I have Spatial Rend and Super Power, um, Power Gem is actually pretty useful as well, but, I don't know, I think I'm actually going to avoid, uh, Yeah, I think I'm actually going to ignore that. I don't see any reason to have camouflage. Just kind of, I mean, at least not this early on. If I really need to, I'll go find, like, a move. Uh... All right, guys, I made it to Cherry Grove City. Uh, I didn't want to show you too much of the grinding. Uh, or just kind of walking here. It wasn't really worth it. Um, you're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay, everyone is a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I can teach you a few things. Okay, then follow me. This little man, this little old man, is Usain Bolt's grandfather. Look how he just darted away. Trying to tell me, oh, because... Why can't you run in this universe without running shoes? Hmm? Can you not walk without shoes? Is this a universe where you always need to have something on your feet? Doesn't make any sense. Why can't I ride a bicycle but not a skateboard? Or a scooter? These are unanswered questions. I just want answers to them. Now, you know this old man is senile because he's just pointing out shit like that like we really care. This is Route 30. This is the sea. Like, uh, excuse me, old man. Excuse me. Go back to the senior citizen home where you belong. The pills will be coming out shortly. Oh, now he wants to show me his house. Uh, where is the rape whistle when you need it? Stranger danger. Oh, he gave me running shoes. Yay, I now have the, the running shoes, guys. So we can run around all day. Alright, so we made it to the first town um 
cherries grow, but I'm probably going to end the video around here, guys. Uh, I'm probably going to explore the town a little bit, uh, but for the next video, we are going to work on getting our first encounters. But uh, this was a nice little introduction back into Pokemon Heart Gold. Uh, if you want to see uh, King Stratos' perspective, go check out his video. Link will be in the description below, guys. Um, no spoilers, but I did hear he also pulled another starter Pokemon uh, for his starter. So, if you want to go see what that was, of course, hit the link. But, without further ado, I'm going to end the video here, guys. But, if you wouldn't mind, hit that like button just so you can tell me how much you appreciated the video. Uh, as always, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. You always should hit that subscribe button. Uh, and hit that little bell next, next to the subscribe button if you want to know when my next video is about to be dropped. Uh, I know, once again, guys, I haven't streamed in a little bit. Like I said in the update video I dropped earlier, that uh, I'm going to be working more on doing pre-recorded videos than streams. Don't fear, my streams are not going away. Uh, they're just going to be more time in between them. And they're probably going to be more uh, of a purpose behind them when I want to do my streams. I want to get to the point where I can do charity streams, guys. I really like uh, just that mechanic of really giving back to your community and helping a good cause um, while playing a fun game with other, with other people. Uh, so yeah, guys, uh, always hit those buttons. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you think I've made the right choice in the starter Pokemon. Um, and give me your predictions. Give me your predictions for the first thing I'll pull. I, I'll pull one Pokemon every route. Um, so let's, let's see what we can grab. All right, guys. Thanks for chilling with the video, and I hope you enjoyed it. Peace.